First of all, uh, the key challenge now is to ensure that after the COVID pandemic, ministers of finance, prime ministers, increase the budget for health. We had a period we, I called the Cinderella. The Cinderella of healthcare was invited to the palace with the prime minister, with the minister of finance, and got additional resources. Now the Cinderella is back in the kitchen, and we need to make sure that we make a very powerful case of health and health systems as a source of growth, well-being, stability and security. That's the first point. And to do that, we have to do indeed what you're suggesting. We need to show that there is value for money. We need to demonstrate to our Ministry of Finance where the money goes and what is the actual return. They see the health system as a dark hole where you throw resources and nothing comes out. They are, we are called a spending a ministry, not an investing ministry. So a lot of our work is to demonstrate how the allocation of resources in certain areas, importantly public health, importantly primary health care, importantly integrated care, will have returns in the efficiency of the health system, will have returns in the value for money, which ultimately will uh, return, will have an impact on the well-being and the growth and sustainability of the society.